The cane toad they muse is one of the most intensively studied anoran species worldwide. It is thus remarkable that the distinctive toe-waving behavior of this species has not been reported in earlier literature. This is the toad Australians have loved to hate ever since the 1930s, when it was imported from Hawaii to prey on certain kinds of annoying beetles and then began reproducing itself uncontrollably. But the notion that nothing much in Australia likes to eat cane toads is incorrect. Shine and Hagman once dissected 28 juvenile cane toads and found that other cane toads made up 64% of the total 149 prey items. Cane toad cannibalism, they reported happily, may be more common than previously reported. Shine and Hagman collected toads in the Adelaide River floodplain and transported them to a laboratory in Sydney, housing them under strict security in glass aquaria. For each trial run, they filmed what happened during the first five minutes a cane toad got to see whatever was in a neighboring box. The filming made it possible to study the kinematics of toe-waving behavior by captive cane toads, and in particular to count the number of times an individual lifted and lowered its toe per second. Shine and Hagman constructed a machine to simulate the waving toe of a toad. We amputated the longest toe of the rear foot of a dummy toad, a taxidermic mount from a dead animal, and placed the dummy toad in the smaller compartment, positioned so the rubber toe replaced the one we had removed. A replacement toe painted a natural brown color, it turns out, elicits a better response than one painted black, white, or blue.